If you have updated your cell phone recently, you may have noticed something new. It's called COVID-19 exposure notifications. Apple and Google are rolling it out as a way to help track the virus. And it's raising questions like, are they tracking me? As 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz explains, it's a potential way to help connect the dots. It's right there in your phone settings, COVID-19 exposure notifications. It's causing a social media buzz with comments like, this is scary. The iOS downloaded this piece, so your phone now has it. But Mary Dickerson, Chief Information Security Officer for the University of Houston says, it's not that scary or invasive. It allows that phone, if there is an app that can use that particular piece of software, it will allow for this tracking to occur. What's on your phone is not an app. It's technology that would allow an app if one is created for public health departments and if you download it to track people who've been exposed to the virus. In theory, here's how it would work. If you and I are both at Starbucks and I have it enabled on my phone and you have it enabled on your phone, our phones will exchange the random ID number. So I will get a listing of your ID number in my phone because I have been in proximity with you. Then if either user tests positive for COVID-19, they could then go back into the app and share the information with the users they were in contact with. So far, only three states have said they want to create such an app. And if one were eventually to be created for Texas, you would have to download it yourself and opt in. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.